Today we're going to talk about the connection between weight loss and sleep. Your workout routine and diet are perfect, and even your heart is in the right place, but still, no matter how hard you try, how hard you work, you struggle with the process and can't get the results you want. The worst thing is that someone else who follows the same exact program gets the results you want. And finally, when you talk to the person, you both share the common approach to weight loss. You eat meals focused on lean protein and vegetables. You exercise at least three times per week, focusing on both weights and cardio. And you know which foods to eat, and truly, you stick to the diet. Yet there's a huge difference between you two, and you're the one that continues to struggle. You can't maintain your focus. You have a hard time controlling your hunger, always craving sweets, and despite your biggest efforts in the gym, you don't get the results you want. What's the problem? Why isn't your exercise working? Maybe you don't know how to train properly. Maybe you lack the willpower. Maybe it's genetics. Maybe there's just nothing you can do about it. Well, there's definitely an answer to your question. And there's definitely a solution for you. Studies show that if you're trying to lose weight, the amount of sleep you get may be just as important as diet and exercise. Keep watching this video to find out exactly how a lack of sleep undoes your exercising efforts. Most people who are trying to lose weight believe that healthy weight loss revolves around eating and movement. Simply put, to look better, you need to eat less and move more. Between living your life, working and exercising, you're probably forgetting to sleep enough. Or even worse, you don't realize that sleep is the key to being rewarded your diet and fitness efforts. Let's take a look at some epidemiological research that found a link between sleep and weight gain. Several studies have been conducted looking at the correlation between body fat and sleep. The results of the research indicate an inverse correlation. Less sleep is being associated with more body fat and that further associated with more fat mass gained over time. According to a study published in Annals Internal Medicine, sleeping less than six hours per night can reduce and even undo the benefits of dieting. When our bodies receive less than adequate rest, the amount of fat loss is cut in half. Due to hormonal imbalance, you may become hungrier, feel less satisfied after meals, and lack energy you need to exercise. You may be thinking this is correlation research and therefore it's not conclusive. However, there is a persistent relationship between less sleep time and greater fat mass. The link persists even after controlling the possible confounding factors. For example, in a study published in the Journal of Sleep Medicine, researchers have excluded the possible compounding agents and concluded that the association between a lack of sleep and weight gain persists even after controlling demographic, lifestyle, work, and health-related factors. We should also mention that researchers have found out that shorter sleep increases expression of genetic risk for higher body weight. At the same time, longer sleep duration may suppress genetic influences on body weight. So how exactly does sleep deprivation affect weight loss? Try to remember how you feel when waking up after a bad night of sleep. Do you feel exhausted, dazed, or even confused? Maybe a little bit grumpy. If you do, you should know your brain is not the only one. Your metabolism, and especially your fat cells, feel the same way too. When you're sleep deprived, your body experiences metabolic grogginess. The researchers from the University of Chicago came up with this term after observing that, due to a lack of sleep, the body's ability to properly use insulin becomes completely disrupted. Epidemiological research shows that a strong correlation between abnormal sleep patterns and metabolic syndrome. Lack of sleep over time leads to insulin resistance, hypertension, diabetes type 2, and obesity. Reducing sleep for only two hours can lead to a state of insulin resistance in otherwise healthy people within a week. Reducing your sleep time to four hours affects your metabolism so severely that insulin resistance can be developed even after one single night. So why is insulin so important for weight loss? Well, insulin is a peptide hormone that regulates your body's ability to process food into energy. Insulin resistance is a very bad thing for weight loss because when insulin is functioning well, fat cells remove fatty acids and lipids from your bloodstream and prevent fat storage. If you're insulin resistant, the lipids will circulate in your bloodstream, which leads to producing more insulin. Eventually, the excess insulin will start storing fat instead of using it. This is not only how you become fat, but it's also how you increase your chances of getting diabetes. Apart from insulin, sleep deprivation affects three hormones related to weight gain. Ghrelin, the hunger hormone, which tells your body when it's hungry and when to eat. Leptin, the satiety hormone, which tells your brain when it's full and cortisol, a stress hormone that activates upon waking and conserves energy as fat stores to use them for fuel during the day. The mentioned hormones are disrupted due to a lack of sleep which results in making you feel constantly hungry and therefore hindering your ability to lose weight. Here's how hunger is controlled by the two hormones leptin and ghrelin. Leptin is a hormone that's produced in your fat cells and it tells your brain when you're full. Ghrelin is known as the hunger hormone. 
And the more you produce it, the more you stimulate hunger and at the same time, reduce the amount of calories you burn and increasing the amount of fat you store. To successfully lose weight, you need to control leptin and ghrelin and almost every other hormone in your body. These two are significantly induced by sleep. Research shows that a lack of sleep increases hunger and particularly depresses leptin while at the same time increases the amount of ghrelin you produce on a daily basis. Poor sleep is also linked to changes in serotonin levels, a hormone that significantly influences your appetite. Lack of sleep increases the levels of stress hormone called cortisol and activates the reward centers in your brain that trigger your need for serotonin. Serotonin is often released by consuming fat and carbs. So this is why you may be constantly craving sweets and junk food. So briefly explain it. Cortisol makes you want food more, while sleep loss also causes your body to produce more ghrelin. A combination of high ghrelin and cortisol basically shuts down the areas of your brain, leave you feeling satisfied after a meal, meaning you'll feel hungry all the time, even if you just ate a big and heavy meal. The hormonal imbalances caused by a lack of sleep we just mentioned above result in an internal battle that makes it almost impossible to lose weight, even if you do everything right. As if everything we mentioned isn't enough, sleep loss also sabotages your gym time. No matter whether you want to lose weight or gain muscle mass, in order to lose fat, you need muscles. Why? Because muscles are the enemy of fat, and they help you burn it. However, a lack of sleep is the enemy of muscle, and studies have shown that sleep deprivation reduces protein synthesis, your body's ability to make new muscles, and causes muscle loss. Even short-term deprivation may completely undo your exercising efforts. According to research, long-term sleep deprivation may result in higher fat mass gains due to insulin resistance, while short-term deprivation appears to hinder fat loss attempts by reducing the percentage of weight loss that is actually fat mass. In a study published by the Annals of Internal Medicine in 2010, sleep deprivation adversely affects nutrient partitioning during weight loss. Studies show that in the case of sleep deprivation, the body compensates for a lack of GH during the day, and overall exposure to GH is left not significantly different. However, that's when cortisol comes in to mess things up even more. Cortisol, which is triggered by sleep deprivation, also slows down the production of growth hormone. So, when you're sleep deprived, the already reduced production of growth hormone is further slowed down by the high cortisol levels in your body. When you're suffering a sleep debt, this makes everything you do more challenging, especially your workouts. So, if you're someone who doesn't particularly enjoy exercising, this will make it almost impossible. As you can see, the connection between sleep and weight gain is very hard to ignore. And getting a proper night's rest is equally as important as sticking your diet and training routine. With our hectic schedules and lifestyles, it may be very hard to get a recommended 8 hours of sleep per night. However, the least you can do is make sure that one bad night of sleep isn't followed up by more. It doesn't sound like much, but at least you'll be off to a good start. If you liked the video, hit the like button. And make sure you click subscribe and don't forget to hit that little bell to get notified every time we come out with new content. Have an incredible day.